Celebrities who regret being Disney child stars. It's no secret that Disney Channel is known for cranking out stars. If 15 years old on the network were not trying to hand out both singing and acting, were they really on the Disney Channel? Disney was signing record labels with their actors and promoting their music on the channel between every commercial. By the time the second season of the most popular shows had aired, the lead actor most likely had already had a debut single out, if not an album. Whether you name any millennial icon today, there's a high chance their career began on the Disney Channel. However, not all the stars feel gratitude toward their debut roles. Here are the 10 Disney child stars who regret their time on the network. But before we start, I'd want you to hit that red subscribe button so that you never miss out on any of our videos. Without further ado, let's begin. Demi Lovato. Poor Demi has had no shortage of negative press surrounding her since she first graced the stage in Camp Rock. She has been open about her eating disorder and was quick to call Disney out for making a poor joke about eating disorders in an episode of Shake It Up. Um, my favorite part about the show is when I do the quick change and then I come back out for Don't Forget. Miley Cyrus. Miley ranks in the top list of Disney Channel child stars who made it big. Unfortunately, in more recent years, she shared about the body dysphoria she faced on the sets of Hannah Montana, having makeup artists and stylists defining their standards of beauty for her at just the age of 14. She also claims the maturity levels required of her on the network caused her to lash out during her 20s. Lucky Lou. So I love to watch and kind of, you know, judge and <laughs> vote on what my favorite thing is anyone's worn. And of course, I love Gaga laying on the stairs and right. her full extra. Right, I live for go. it. Bella Thorne. Shake It Up only aired for three seasons. But according to Bella Thorne, it was enough time for her and co-star Zendaya to feel pitted against each other. She also posted on her Instagram about being sexually assaulted at a young age and opened up this year in an interview with The Build about the abuse while working for Disney. Up to me and asked for a photo, but I can't have this out. Like something like this could be very, very bad for me. People could say, how could you do that, you whore? Christy Carlson Romano. Kim, possibly herself, had a lot to say about her time as a child actor. Recently, Christy got real about her struggles with depression and her desire to be a normal kid. She said that she realized that she had chosen acting at a young age over a chance to experience normal life milestones. Cole Sprouse. Cole started acting when he was a baby in the 1993 on the show, Grace Under Fire. Although he has continued acting throughout his life, he said that he needed to take a break after the Sweet Life series ended. In 2016, he said that acting on a network felt mechanical and compared himself to an automation. Dylan Sprouse Dylan admits that his life on the Sweet Life of Zack and Cody set was not so sweet. The older the twins got, the more they wanted to create liberties on the show. They pitched an idea to Disney, and the producers laughed in their faces, so they know it was not the place for them anymore. Shia LaBeouf Shia LaBeouf is now a household name and has starred in some of the biggest blockbuster films in the past decade. However, his acting career did not begin due to a passion for acting. He acted because it kept his parents from fighting. He has attributed the Disney Channel to impact on his mental health, causing PTSD negatively. Joe Jonas Joe Jonas has not tried to hide his regret at starting his career on the network. He has said that Disney would never have been an option for him if he thought he had another shot at making it in the industry somewhere else. Nick Jonas Like his brother Joe Jonas, Nick Jonas thought Disney was his only shot at making it in the industry. All three Jonas brothers opened up about how doing the show Jonas stunted their growth and made people assume that they didn't take their music career seriously. Rowan Blanchard as a young teen, Rowan already knew it would be difficult to be taken seriously after working as the Disney kid. There was also a talk that Rowan might have had a brief chat with the producers of Girls Meet World about the sexuality of her character since Rowan herself identifies as gay. That's all for today. I hope you liked the video. If you did, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel so that you never miss any amazing video from us.